Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Uh, scripture reading. First Corinthians chapter 11. We give the verse 22. First Corinthians chapter 11. We give the verse 22.
Put that down for the left. Yes, I do. I want to talk about a road map from earth to glory. That's the second. The other part of the world that actually made would do you. You want to know what that map is like. Have you ever took a trip? Tell us somebody. And you didn't know how to get where you were going? Tell us somebody. I know they got uh, GPS now. But, but then when you took a trip, you didn't know where you got was going. Uh, you were lost. You couldn't find your direction. Sometimes they stop. And you can ask other people, the whole talk with how to get there. And sometimes when they give this instruction, you still get lost. Amen. The whole talk with That's me. You, you can pull over and ask another person. Uh -huh. I, I remember going just right over there and over and over. I was trying to find this place. And it wasn't no joke on And uh, I asked the man, I said, uh, where is the field home? And this man was in the car, I mean, some side was car. He said, I'm not from here, I don't know. <laughs> so, so, but what I'm saying here is, a lot of times when people give you direction, you still get up. Yeah. But, but, but when you stop and get your roadmap, yeah. talk to me here, and you find your destination, tell somebody, yeah. you, 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 you can go where you need to go. Uh -huh. Is that right? Now, I don't folks, I don't get read road now. But, but, but I want you to know just as, I'm going to take the time here, you get lost physically, you can get lost spiritually. Right. I'm going to do that. I'm going to do that. i take my time. Yeah. Amen. Just as, you get lost physically, you can get lost spiritually. All right. Now, now, I'm not going to talk all about St. John, the 14th chapter, but I want to talk about what Thomas said. Uh, 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 uh. When Jesus, first of all, said, if I go and prepare a place for you, I will come again and receive you unto myself, that where I am, I'm going to go ahead, there ye may be also. And wherever I go, ye know, and the way ye know. Thomas said to him, Lord, we know not whether thou goest, and how can we know the way? Now, 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 now that's what Thomas said. Now, now, a lot of us who claim to be Christian, yet are still lost. The Bible says a tree is known by the fruit it bears. The Bible says, Jesus said, by their fruits, three choice ones, he didn't say that, by their fruits, ye shall know them. He said that. Now, now, you have never seen a path on a plum tree. That's right, man. That's right. Come on, talk to me here. A lot of folks who claim who wear the name Christian, but yet are still lost. Well. God has given us a clear roadmap in His Word. Yeah. And today I want to try to share you something about this roadmap. If you are unsure about your salvation, I encourage you to carefully listen to the direction. All right. If you have been saved, I encourage you to listen to make sure you're on the right road. All right. All right. You can't tell me you're on the right road and you back back. Right. You can't tell me you're on the back road, right road, and, 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 and all you're doing is grinning and lying in somebody's face. Come on. Come on. You can't tell me you're on the right road and you're saying what somebody said, add to it to somebody else. Come on. You can't tell me you're on the right road and when, when you have a meeting and things close to stay in there, next thing you know, you're told everybody. Oh, yeah. Pretty joy, Russell. Awesome. Awesome. Uh, but in God's word, that's all right. Nobody, nobody had to say, man. 
But I'm going I'm to I'm call this here. But I, I got to tell you this. Uh, even sometimes, you're the road now. If you're not careful, you'll miss the turn. Come on, talk to me here. Going to the field yesterday, all up there in the dash. It tells you the road and so forth. Uh, Adam Blaine Eve, I'm gonna say what Sister Taylor Bible talk. It showed the road we was going to. Passed on by, that was the road there. Right there on the screen, all you had to do was take the turn. Come on, talk to me here. But the bottom line is, there is a road that will lead us from earth to glory. Amen. We got to be on the right road. Amen. Hello, somebody. Now, when you think about it, where in the world are we? Where in the world are we? Even if you turn your earthly GPS system on, the first thing you have to determine is your present location. All right. I'm talk to you again. Is that right? That's right? Well, Romans 3 and 23 says, for we all have sinned and come short of the glory of God. It cannot be said any clearer than this. All have sinned and come short of God's standards of hope. The Bible tells us as it is written, there's none righteous. No, not one. Most people resent being called a sinner. Come on, talk to the brother. They will argue that they are not perfect. Yet they don't like being called sinful. And in today's world, there are few and few things that men classify as sin. Come on, somebody. Take money, they don't call it stealing, they don't bail me. I guess a bail for me. Stealing is stealing. Hello, somebody. Got a lifestyle that doesn't line up with the Word of God. They don't say I'm sinning. This now all turns to life, God. Pretty joy, brother. Hello, somebody. Few and few of things that we call sin. We want to recognize and we want to call it everything else but what it really is. Come on, talk to me. Mm. Jesus spoke this power. I'm closing. Two men went up in the temple to pray. One of Pharisees and the other one a public. The Pharisees stood and prayed thus within himself. God, that would say, I thank thee that I'm not as other men are. Extortioners. Unjust, adulterers, or even this one. Now, before I finish this, I want to tell you, I always talk. It take one to know. He went on to say, I fast twice in the week. I give tithes of all that I possess. It's in the word. And the publican standing of all. Would not lift up so much as eyes unto heaven, but smote on his breast, saying, Lord God, God, be merciful to me, a sinner. Jesus said, I tell you that this man went down to his house justified rather than God. For everyone that exalted himself shall be made. And he that humbled himself shall be exalted. Uh huh. If we confess our sin, God is faithful and just to forgive us of our sins and to cleanse us from all unrighteousness. 
Again, the question was, where in the world are we? I won't talk to him about it. Ah, uh, well, uh, the Bible says, uh -huh, we all are sinners. Yeah. And no sin shall ever enter into heaven. Uh -huh. uh, I'm on my way to heaven. But sin is not going to enter into heaven. Uh -huh. Then what happened? I'm glad you had. If we keep on going down that road, well, you need to write in your Bible uh, a Roman 3 and 23. Uh -huh. The rage of sin is death, yes. but the gift of God is eternal life through Jesus Christ our Lord. Yes, sir. You notice that this verse has two parts. I'm trying to take my time here. Uh, the bad news and the good news. And I'm so glad he wrote the bad news first. The Bible says the ways of sin is death. What will happen as a result of our sin? Some people believe that God will one day weigh the good against the bad. And if any person has more good than bad, he will get in heaven. Friends, uh, brothers, uh, and sisters. Yeah, you're going in the wrong direction. Uh -huh. If you're trying to find your way to heaven, yeah. the Bible says the wages uh, of sin is death. Yeah. One sin uh, will keep a man out of heaven and cause you to spend eternity in Hades. Uh, thank God, all right. The Bible says, uh, but the gift of God uh, is eternal life. Uh, through Jesus Christ, our Lord. Is that right? Well, Christ uh -huh, is the source uh, for our rescue. Uh, no other person uh, can rescue us uh, but Jesus Christ. Uh, that same book tells us uh, for God, I'm going to read here, commandments his love toward us that while we were yet sinners, Christ uh, uh, died for us. Is that all right? Does yeah. anybody here know he died for your sin? Yeah. Well, uh, I see him uh, Thomas saying, Lord, uh, we know not whether uh, thou goest and how uh, uh, can uh, uh, we know the way. Uh, and God, all right, uh, yeah. this same Thomas uh, has seen Jesus uh, turn uh, water uh, in the wine uh, at the wedding uh, in Canaan uh, of Galilee. Uh, yeah. But he said, uh, we know not uh, uh, thou uh, uh, and God, all right, uh, how uh, did we know the way? Uh, and God, all right, uh, this same Thomas uh, has seen Jesus uh, heal the woman uh, that had the issue of blood uh, for 12 uh, a long years. Uh, he's still asking, how uh, can we uh, know the way? Uh, and God, all right, uh, this same uh, Thomas uh, has seen Jesus uh, till the man uh, at the pool uh, of Bethesda uh, to rise, uh, till the bed and walk. Uh, and God, all right, uh, this same uh, uh, Peter uh, has seen the same uh, Thomas and Peter uh, has seen. Uh, uh, Jesus do all of that uh, but still uh, he didn't uh, uh, know the way uh, and God alright uh, there's somebody here uh, under the sound of my voice uh, the Lord have uh, with miracles uh, uh, in your life uh, and you still uh, uh, don't know uh, uh, don't know the way uh, and God alright uh, you see uh, and God, all right, uh, Jesus 
said, uh, can I preach to y'all? Yeah, I am uh, the way, uh, and only one way, uh, and no need uh, of trying to go another way. Uh, there's only uh, one way uh, to the Father. If I decide to uh, go to Tupelona, uh, I can go to Abraham uh, and go to Tupelona. Uh, I can go to Oklahoma uh, and go to Tupelona. Uh, I can even go uh, round by Jackson, Mississippi uh, and go to Tupelona. Uh, but Jesus uh, is the only way. Uh, and uh, my God, uh, I like to leave you here. Uh, sometimes uh, the word uh, the road the pass, uh, ain't God all right, uh, I got to leave you here, uh, but the first Adam uh, fell uh, in the garden uh, of Eden, uh, can I, uh, I get a witness here, uh, the last Adam uh, uh, saved us, uh, our gender, uh, on the hill uh, of God, uh, of Calvary, uh, I ain't a uh, uh, God alright. Uh, I got to uh, uh, get ready uh, to leave you here. Uh, you don't want uh, to kill me. Uh, to keep you too long. Uh, but Jesus uh, did not say uh, a lot uh, about temptation. Uh, he met it. Uh, struggled with it in the wilderness. Uh, covered it uh, and left the wilderness. Uh, and the power of the Spirit, uh, ain't God all right, uh, Jesus uh, did not say much uh, about working a job, uh, a lot of folks, uh, young and old, uh, don't want to work, uh, he gave dignity uh, to work by working, uh, and uh, a carpenter's bench uh, with his earthly father, uh, ain't God all right, uh, Jesus uh, didn't attempt uh, to prove uh, the existence of God. Uh, he brought God uh, to the well uh, in his life. Uh, and God, all right, uh, he didn't argue uh, that God is a prayer. Uh, he prayed uh, and God uh, answered his prayer. Uh, and God, all right, uh, I'm going to leave you here now. Uh, I want you to know that uh, that the beauty in uh, Jesus uh, did not say much about a uh, uh, family and friend uh, and the need uh, of human sympathy. Uh, but one day uh, uh, he went to the grave uh, where his friend Lazarus uh, had been dead uh, for four uh, a long days. Uh, ain't God all right? Uh, Jesus did uh, not teach a uh, long lesson. Uh, about humanity, uh, but in the last supper, uh, he cleared himself uh, with a towel uh, and washed the feet uh, of the disciples. Uh, and God, all right, uh, I believe he here. Uh, he didn't tell us uh, a whole lot uh, about love and our enemies. Uh, he did say it, uh, but he taught us uh, to do those things uh, in person and practice. Uh, and God, all right. Uh, as John, uh, as I get ready to close here, uh, revealed in us, uh, uh, number one, uh, uh, in the beginning, uh, uh, was the word, uh, uh, and the word uh, uh, was with God, uh, uh, and the word uh, uh, was God, uh, uh, that's chapter one, uh, uh, chapter two, uh, uh, John uh, uh, reveals uh, uh, how Jesus turned a uh, uh, walk. In the wine. Uh, chapter 3 reveals a uh, 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 Jesus uh, 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 telling the demons a uh, uh, little more and a uh, 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 man uh, uh, is born again. Uh, uh, he cannot see uh, uh, the kingdom of heaven. Uh, uh, and God alright uh, uh, and John uh, uh, the fourth chapter uh, 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 Jesus tells the woman uh, 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 at the well uh, uh, if you drink his water uh, she was never on the first again. And I get a witness to her. In the sixth chapter, he tells the little man uh, that the food was set together uh, to make the thing in the world. Uh, and I don't give it to her. Uh, in the sixth chapter, uh, Jesus uh, fell in love with two uh, with two kids uh, and five little children. Uh, and five little children. Jesus, the light of the 